that's how it goes, Sakurai. Like, people ask me to go back to play Guild Wars 2 when I'm taking one night off. And I just tell them, no, I'll play it tomorrow, or I'll play it the next time I stream, but I do like other games, so, yeah. I'm gonna continue playing what I have set to play that night. I am a multi-gaming channel, even though a lot of it is Guild Wars 2. The reason it's so much of it is Guild Wars 2 is because I enjoy playing Guild Wars 2 a lot. But I enjoy playing other games, too. Deal by Desire again. Can you just tell us I love this card? Fuck it. Bombing this shit. I hit- No! Stop it! I hate this card so much. I got it, I think. Yeah, I think I got it. Yeah, you you can have more emotes than you actually have unlocked. Like, unlocking the, the different milestones are not permanently unlocked. So, I reached 100 subs at one point and got access to those two sub emotes. Sub slots, I don't have a But since I have since been fallen under that milestone, I can't... There are no slots to make... To have those deletion... Those, there are no slots open, basically. And I need slots open in order to to make updates. So like if I were to delete two and then delete the ones that needed updating, then I would I'd be able to update them. But otherwise I have to, to remove emotes. And I I have heard quite quite strongly from my subs that they would rather have the emotes as they are than have emotes taken away. Which is perfectly understandable. And part of the reason why I wanted to gather feedback from them in the first place. I'm surprised I'm doing all this while talking. Like normally I'm I'm really shitty when I talk and try and play. Mm-hmm. Da -da. I don't wanna die. Come on, Yoshka. Get out of your cloud of kunai. Thank you. 